Hey everyone, happy new year. So here we are, another year in the books and ready for a new beginning, at least I know I am. And I wanted to give you an update on what we saw in the market in 2021 and what we can look for in the housing market for this upcoming year. So 2021 was unprecedented. Uh, many records were broken. A lot of this year was unpredictable and we ended the year on historic lows and historic highs. We ended with in December, 1,477 active listings on the market, which is, it's incredible. So let's unpack that a little bit. On average, there's usually about 12,000 homes on the market at the end of the year. And prospectively, we need about 15,000 active listings on the market to be considered a stable market. So uh, currently, we have less than 10% of the inventory we would need in order to be considered stable. So for buyers out there right now, there's not a lot of choices for them. But what's really interesting about this is even though inventory is historically low, we saw more buyers than ever before purchase homes last year. So even though inventory is on the low side, demand is still superseding and purchasing homes faster than ever, faster than we've ever seen before. So uh, with these figures going into this year, it's no surprise that it's obviously still a very strong seller's market and there's no sign of a slowdown, at least not in the near future. So buyers really need to be prepared for the market to be incredibly competitive again, and they need to have the right mindset and a strategy in place that's going to put them in the best position to purchase. And we're going to see huge equity growth again. So last year, we saw an increase in equity overall at a smidge over, it was 16, a little over 16%. So that means if you own an attached home, you gained an average of about 50,000 in equity. And if you own a detached home, you gained an average of $100,000 in equity, which are both the biggest equity gains we've seen over the course of a year in history, in the entire Denver metro market history. So for my homeowners, if you want to see the equity that you earned um, and what your property is worth today, go ahead and reach out to me and I'd love to send you that analysis. And if you're not a homeowner, come talk to me. So it's absolutely attainable to get into a home and start building equity. This is going to be another huge year of building equity. So it's not too late to start making money work for you passively. So some folks last year earned more money through equity of home ownership than they did at their own jobs. So think about that. I'm available for you to put together a plan that can absolutely help you accomplish the same thing. So on that note, I hope that everyone is just as fired up as I am about a new year full of opportunities. And if you have any questions, let me know. I would love to help you. Thank you so much.